next step is to work on my video to get ready for tomorrow and take some pictures so come along with me <sighs> good morning so it is wednesday november 1st my first day not having a job again <laughs> for anyone that knows me i am a project kind of person i love working on new things and then scooting on out of there um, and that's kind of what i did with okanagan county they wanted a new uh, they were implementing a new public record system um, and so i came in and i helped them set it up and trained all the staff that'll be using it and basically worked myself out of a job but that is fine because my true love is kathy's curations and that is where my focus is going to be but i thought i'd share a little bit about my curating life today in my little rv on my dad in my dad's backyard and kind of show you what a day is like now it is november 1st we are getting hard frost at night so we've had to unhook the water so i have to do things a little bit different now including bringing in jugs of water for washing hands brushing teeth cleaning dishes and in fact that is what i'm getting ready to do right now so i have this amazing cook stop, uh, top here that just heats up really fast and as you can see i've got the water boiling so that's excellent um, i've already cleaned this pan mostly it still needs cleaning on the outside but it's very clean on the inside and then i have my little bit of dishes i don't uh, i don't use a lot of dishes this thing i started washing but i'm going to go ahead right now and pour this pan of scalding hot water on to all my silverware and that is plugged up and there is a little bit of dawn dish soap in there and so i'm just going to and i kind of on the bottom is my cutting board so everything's just going to get nice soaking um, the hot water and then I'm going to add I've got a little jug there um, and a couple more jugs by the door so I'll just add a little bit more water to that to get it to a temperature that I can use to wash it up and then we'll do all that and then we'll give them a good rinse with the bottled water and those will be good to go so this is my little kitchen setup and basically I have everything I need I got my cooktop I got a little toaster oven and then I have a microwave, my coffee. That is my ultimate must have a coffee pot. I make coffee every day. Um, but just basically everything I have is what I need and I just really don't have a lot of extra. Uh, it's my sweet boy, Grayson. He's living over in Graham with James, my ex-boyfriend. Had to leave him because the pups are just, they love him so much um, and they're very aggressive. I do want to get a cat again someday because I am a cat lover, but for now, um, and it'll be probably an older cat that tolerates ducks. But we'll just kind of show you again how I utilize every space. So I added this little uh, coat rack thing that I got like on clearance at Walmart. So it was really cheap. It has several hooks. So it's got all my coats. I got rain coats, warm coat, my curating life jacket. This is great for going for walks so people can see me and the doggos. Um, and then this is my bathroom. Again, very tight. Um, I utilize every space. So right now, since it's getting cold, I hung up towels to cover the windows, kind of block some of the coolness. And then I also use this um, to just hang all my cleaning stuff that there just really isn't room for under the sink in the kitchen. Um, still currently using my toilet. Um, however, that's we're going to have to go to a portable one here and then just do dumping. And that's fine. I can handle that. <laughs> Um, my tiny little sink and again usually I have a jug of water in fact I need to stick that back up there now that I went in the house my dad's house and filled it my, my makeup just again my basics nice little um, cabinet here again just my basics now I will show you in here but it's kind of a mess this is kind of 
We're gonna keep towels, medications, underclothing, and then just anything else. And it's so funny when I open this, it's like opening a refrigerator. It's so cold in there, but plenty. And then down here is uh, garbage sacks and toilet paper. And then this, of course, being the shower, I was using it up until just recently, but now it is holding, this is all crafts things, my shopping bags, my dirty clothes, and then when I'm done with dishes, I put my drying rack in here too. So it's gonna be storage for a while until uh, it warms up or again, I find a new place to live. I've got a great, uh, refrigerator and freezer really nice size this is the extent of my dress pants and jackets um but i don't really need anymore and yes you can hear yakking away um is uh i got this i love them i'm gonna mute them though um jamie jamie and zeb just got back from england so they're showing all their english stuff i love to watch them while i'm working uh, which I am working on the next video that I'll be uploading tomorrow for Thrifting Thursday. And then this is all the stuff that I recently got that I will be, will be my next thrifting video. Um, I bring stuff home and then I kind of wrap everything up to keep it safe while I'm storing it. But today is take pictures and list day while I'm watching my favorites here, working on my videos. This is my little photo area. Works pretty decent for, you know, uh, just having a nice white background. Up here is, is more storage, um, <laughs> kind of a mishmash of things. I gotta give that doll to my niece. Here's my, um, all my aloe plants planted. I think we lost out of all of them two. So the rest of them are thriving. Got my little waterer. And of course, I do all things with love, grace, and gratitude. I hope we all do. And then of course we got this side, which is the lounge. And Sawyer is lounging. Are you lounging? Yeah. It's nice being home because then they can be in when it's chilly and then go out and play. This is their little area. I have a little floor heater. If I don't need a whole lot of heat. Um, yeah, me, me. Yes. And then um, this wonderful, I've got it kind of turned down because it was, was getting warm, but it definitely stays really nice and warm in here. And then this is the last storage area, which so there's my medications, food, and then of course the dog food and treats there. And that is my home. This is my version of curating life. that is how you do that. So I guess it was about a jug and a half to uh, get enough water to clean and rinse. So I'm going to go for these two to go fill some more. But let's uh, we'll let those dry and we're going to move on to working on my video. All right, so I put on some nice light jazz music just so I can enjoy some relaxing mess. I got my June June over here. <laughs> He's like, what are you talking about? Who are you talking to? 
and I'm getting ready to upload my video. Now at this time I use um, Clipchamp which comes with uh, Microsoft Office. It's not the best certainly but for being a free um, for being free it is awesome and so we're just gonna go ahead and throw it up there and there we go Just doing some editing and then this what is this this is the end screen there we go and so now I just am gonna need to do an intro for this and add it up and do some editing <laughs> 